The Chinese AI Showdown, DeepSeek vs. Alibaba vs. ByteDance. Hello and welcome to today's deep dive into the ever-evolving world of artificial intelligence. The competition in China has just kicked up another notch. Alibaba, one of the country's biggest tech giants, has released an AI model called Quen 2.5 Max, and they claim it outperforms the much-hyped DeepSeek V3. If that sounds like a major move in the AI arms race, trust me it is. We've got the latest developments, fresh insights, and a breakdown of what this clash means for the entire AI landscape, both in China and globally. So buckle up, because there's a lot to unpack. Over the last three weeks, the name DeepSeek has been popping up everywhere in AI news. This small yet aggressive startup has sent shockwaves through Silicon Valley, with some US tech stocks even dipping amid fears that DeepSeek's open source, low-cost approach could reshape the global AI market. DeepSeek's V3 model, unveiled on January 10, the V3 iteration of their AI assistant, quickly drew comparisons to industry heavyweights like OpenAI's GPT-4 and Meta's Llama 3.1. Low-cost disruption, DeepSeek's founder, Liang Wenfeng, has consistently underscored minimal overhead and lean R&D teams, allowing them to bring down token costs to a fraction of what bigger players charge. Surprise R1 release. On January 20th, DeepSeek launched an even more advanced R1 model, which according to the startup, can go head-to-head -head with leading US solutions like OpenAI's O1 at a fraction of the cost. Within an astonishingly brief period, the hype surrounding DeepSeek has skyrocketed to a level rarely seen in the AI realm, prompting a frenzy of activity among leading tech companies across both the US and China. Fearing the loss of their competitive edge, these industry giants are rushing to release public statements that placate jittery shareholders, all while hastily reallocating funds and manpower to strengthen their own AI portfolios before the window of opportunity narrows further. Enter Alibaba. While we typically see corporate announcements, time for maximum visibility, Alibaba chose a different strategy. They revealed Quen 2.5 Max on January 29th, the first day of the Lunar New Year holiday. Most people were off celebrating, but that didn't stop Alibaba's cloud unit from dropping a bold statement on their official WeChat account. Quen 2.5 Max outperforms nearly all benchmarks, including GPT-40, DeepSeek B3, and Meta's Llama 3.1405B. Timing and Pressure Many analysts are interpreting this unusual announcement date as a sign that Alibaba wants to quickly reassert its dominance in the AI arena after DeepSeek's dramatic emergence. Performance claims, beyond surpassing DeepSeek B3, Alibaba also posits that Quen 2.5 Max goes toe-to-toe -to -toe with top-tier Western models, including GPT-4 derivatives. New Info China's Zhichang High Tech Daily cited sources within Alibaba Cloud, claiming Quen 2.5 Max features a new training architecture that cuts inference costs by 12% compared to previous Quen versions. That efficiency angle might directly challenge DeepSeek's reputation for cost-effectiveness. ByteDance, owner of TikTok, has also been making headlines. Two days after DeepSeek introduced R1, ByteDance announced an update to its flagship AM model. Company insiders claim it can outperform Microsoft-backed OpenAI's a one on a testing framework for complex instruction following. Rivalry with DeepSeek ByteDance's leadership has reportedly been highly motivated to release an improved model, seeing DeepSeek's abrupt success as an existential threat, especially in the realm of generative short videos and AI-driven content creation. 1UP Game In a pattern reminiscent of smartphone brand wars, ByteDance is playing the We Can Do Better card subtly echoing DeepSeek's own claim that R1 competes directly with O1. It's not just Alibaba feeling the pressure from DeepSeek's rapid ascent. Nearly every significant Chinese tech player with a foot in AI is scrambling to accelerate development schedules, with some even pulling all-nighters to refine their prototypes and push them into beta testing. In fact, a few have already begun quietly rolling out new features, ignoring the typical downtime over the holiday just to keep pace in this fiercely competitive market. To grasp the significance of Alibaba's Quen 2.5 Max release, it's essential to revisit DeepSeek's earlier chapters. DeepSeek V2's Shock Value Debuting last May, DeepSeek V2 kicked off an AI model price war. It was open source and cost only one new one, 14 cents, per million tokens, forcing Alibaba's cloud unit and other big players to slash their model usage rates by up to 97%. 
Mindset of Founder Liang Wenfeng In a rare July interview, Liang declared that conventional tech giants might not adapt fast enough to the evolving AI environment. Lean operations, minimal overhead, and a flat structure are DeepSeek's recipe for quick iteration and cost advantages. Now, with Quinn 2.5 Max on the stage, Alibaba is hoping to challenge DeepSeek's low price, high-performance narrative, and possibly reclaim market share. While China's AI race has historically been overshadowed by American players like OpenAI and Google, the landscape may be shifting dramatically. Investor jitters in the US. DeepSeek's emergence has already caused tips in leading AI stocks, fueling concerns about American firms soaring R&D budgets versus the startup's lean approach. Regulatory landscape. Some experts predict that if DeepSeek's cost model gains traction, Regulators in various countries will revisit the competitive fairness of large language models and possibly push for open-source developments. Cross-border collaboration or rivalry Partnerships between Chinese and U.S. AI labs could either intensify or diminish. Some American VCs, as reported by TechFocus, are quietly exploring cross-investments with Chinese AI startups to hedge bets. DeepSeek's story and Alibaba's quick retort exemplify how agile innovation can disrupt even the largest incumbents, and how those giants can strike back with resources and brand power. There's no doubt that we'll see more AI model upgrades in the coming weeks. DeepSeek might accelerate its R2 release to maintain momentum, while Alibaba could further slash usage fees or refine Quen 2.5 Max to retain developer interest. Baidu and Tencent both have historically been major players in Chinese AI. Given by dances and Alibaba's bold moves, we can expect them to release news on updated models or partnerships soon. Beyond performance, it's not just about raw model metrics. Efficiency, cost, and real-world applicability are increasingly vital. With global economic shifts, the company that best balances performance with low operational costs might win big in enterprise adoption. The AI sector in China is anything but static. DeepSeek seemingly appeared out of nowhere to rattle established players but Alibaba is determined to protect its crown with Quen 2.5 Max. From ByteDance's fresh claims to the broader question of how cheap yet powerful AI will shake up the market, we're watching a pivotal moment in AI evolution. Ultimately, the winners could be developers and consumers, who may soon enjoy faster, cheaper, and more innovative AI tools, assuming these towering claims hold up. That's the state of the Chinese AI showdown as of right now, with new updates dropping almost daily sometimes even on public holidays, this story is moving fast. If you found this video useful or just love following AI news, hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications. Leave a comment below about which model you think will come out on top. DeepSeek's V3, Alibaba's Quen 2.5 Max, by Dance's flagship, or maybe a contender we haven't even seen yet. Visit Almond Consulting for your latest tech updates.